Welcome back to Tech Accessibility Tutorials. In this video, I am going to demonstrate how to use Describe My Screen option in Be My Eyes application for Windows. You can download and install this application from Microsoft Store and log in using your email, Google, Facebook and Apple account. I have already logged in using my Google account. So without any further delay, let's explore what are the options available here. So let's open Be My Eyes application Middle first. Key. Search box edit, type in text. B, be my eyes app, press right to switch preview, enter, be my eyes, be my eyes. Describe my screen. It has four options. I'm going to show you one by one. I'm going to navigate these options using tab. Describe my screen, left parent keyboard, shortcut, alt plus control plus H, right parent button to activate, press space bar. Describe my screen. When you activate this option, it will analyze and describe what is on the screen. Take picture using built-in camera, left parent keyboard, shortcut, alt plus control plus J, right parent button to activate. Take picture. When you activate this option, it will take a picture using your webcam and describe the image. Describe picture from File Explorer, left parent keyboard shortcut, alt plus control plus K, right parent button to activate, press space bar. Describe picture from File Explorer. When you activate this option, you can upload an image from your File Explorer so that it will analyze and describe the image. Describe clipboard, left parent keyboard shortcut, alt plus control plus L, right parent button to activate, press space bar. Describe clipboard. When you activate this option and if you have a picture, copy to your clipboard so that it will analyze and describe the picture for you. So these are the four options available here. Now let's explore describe my screen feature and demonstrate how it can help in recognizing captures in websites. For this demonstration, I have already opened a website which has a captcha field. Let me open that tab now. I'm going to focus on the captcha field here. Enter, enter captcha edit link. Now I'm going to press keyboard shortcut for describe my screen feature that is Alt Control H. Alt Control H. Be my eyes. Be my AI tab. One of it two. Is plus switch pages. Press Control plus page down. Please wait. Be my AI is writing a message. Dot dot dot. Question to ask the AI edit. Type in text. The page is for logging into Otter V O T P on the unique identification authority of India website. There are two fields to fill out. Colon one. Enter Otter number. Colon this field is marked as required and it indicates that valid data must be entered. Two. Enter captcha. Colon this field is also marked as required and it shows a captcha code. Quote box forty six quote that needs to be entered. There is an option to refresh the captcha. So it read the captcha. Now I want to know what is the exact captcha. So here there is an edit box to ask the AI. Question to ask the AI edit type in text. Question to ask the AI. I'm going to type here what is the captcha. H A T A P A S. What's T A E A C A P C A A. Captcha enter message sent. Please wait. My AI is writing a message. Dot dot dot. The captcha display is quote box forty six quote. Now I want to read this captcha letter by letter. For this purpose, I'm going to press Shift tab. To get to the message list box. Chat with me, my AI list box. Your image, one of four. To move to an item, press the arrow keys. Here, I'm navigating with the down arrow to get to the last the message. Was the, the capture display is quote box of forty-six quote four four. Now, I'm going to turn on this virtual PC cursor by pressing Insert Z or Caps Lock Z if you're using a laptop. Use virtual PC cursor on for UWP apps. Now navigate with the right arrow to get to the capture code. A P C A P T C H A S P D I S P L A Y E D space I S space code. After this code, the capture code begins. A X A four six. So this is the capture code. If you feel difficulty in remembering the capture code, you can use JAWS speech history and copy the code. The command to activate JAWS speech history is insert space then H or Caps lock space then H. Navigate to the captcha code. Select the code and copy the code by pressing Ctrl C and paste it in the captcha field. That's all for today. If you like this video, give it a big thumbs up. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section and don't forget to subscribe.